Today I want to share with you about my Fireside Harp from Backyard Music. Um, I got this one and a couple others in order to put together and teach some friends how to play. I think it's a good option for beginning harpers, maybe if they don't want to know how much they don't know how much they want to invest into harping or whatever. Um, it's a pretty inexpensive choice, but it actually sounds pretty good. Um, let's see. The dimensions, it's 32 inches long, and it's um, about 23 across here. So it's a little bit bigger than some other small harps, but it's also incredibly lightweight because it has a cardboard sound box. Now it's not your typical cereal box cardboard or you know just thin flimsy cardboard. It's, it's a tough reinforced cardboard and you paint the outside and the inside before you fold it and glue it together. So it makes a lightweight, durable, inexpensive harp. I bought this as a kit and it was really easy to assemble. It comes with you know all of the wood pieces are separate, the sound box is flattened out. So what you first paint the sound box I did a little decoration. You can, or you don't have to, obviously. It comes with all the hardware. Um, you have to sand the wood and finish it. And then it's really easy to just, you just glue it together, screw it together at a few points, and then you're ready to go. Um, it takes two people to get the sound box folded and the frame glued on, and then you have to clamp it and leave it for a few days. But um, it's, really, it's really fairly simple. I did it in my kitchen, so I don't, you don't need a workshop to do it. Um, it doesn't make a very big mess, and um, I'm pleased with the outcome. So here's a little bit of how it sounds. Um, I will add, it has a pretty low tension. This is not a gateway harp to pedal harping. Um, it's, it's for, you know, lighter playing, but it sounds good when you play lightly. Let's go up the full range. So I am playing with my nails right now, so that can let me pluck a little more lightly. Um, if I were plucking with the finger pads, you know, it's easy to overplay if you squeeze it too hard. So again, this is not this is not pedal tension. Um, it's pretty easy to squeeze the strings together, but but they're not really like rubber bands. Um, it's just a light, a light tension. Um, so I really recommend this harp um, for someone who wants to have something easy to carry. Um, I've had one of these before. I've had a wearing harp before. Very similar idea. I played it outside. They're very durable. You finish the wood, you finish the sound box. You just be careful with it like any harp. And um, Honestly, if the sound box gets too damaged, you can order a new one. It's, it's really pretty slick. So um, I recommend this harp, and I feel like it's um, a really good option for people to start out or to have an extra harp to drag around where they don't want to take their big harps.